What's up everyone, this is Saiyan Sonic 91 back once again for some more Let's Play No More Heroes. In the last part we took care of some business, taking on a few unlooked at killing missions, and now we're ready to take on rank 4. Well we already were, but I want to make sure we're a little bit more secure and set ready for what we're about to venture into. Because now we're heading into the top... We're in the top five right now. So it's only going to get more bloody and more violent from here on out. Yeah, like it hasn't been violent before. So, let's see what 4 has to offer. Travers, the next rank is 4th. Who is it? But come to think of it, it doesn't really matter, does it? I am sending you a ticket for a show. Look nice. Let's go together. Number four will be there. A show? Wait. This is a date, right? Something like that. Why else would I be getting an oil rub? W what What did you say? Someone's rubbing you down? I'll see you later. Damn you, Japan. Damn you for being so awesome. But, sexism aside, oh, we got mail. Hello? What do we got here? This must be the ticket she was talking about. You know what this is? It's a platinum ticket, reserve seating. Go and give the performance of your life. You can do this. Oh, uh, it must be from her. So we gotta take it to a show! Magic show? As long as it's not America's Got Talent. Jesus. So many people I know watch that crap. To be honest, I don't know why. Since the, the person who always wins that show is almost always like a singer. There's just no point in it. I don't see the appeal. Uh, but crappy reality shows aside, reality or God knows what you consider it. Pretty much in the exact same place once again. Way to reuse the same exact location, Suda. But anyway, let's start number four. Let's see what you're made of, country boy! Yeah, for some reason they give him the longest ass name I've ever seen. But we'll just call him Harvey, just for... Just to keep things on the easy level here. Keep things simple. And of course, gun guy right out of the starting gate. Work and run into the bears. Food, you're gonna pay now, buddy. Damn it, quit shooting. So I can stab you in the face. And down you go. I believe that was the power bomb. And treasure chest. Well, it doesn't matter anymore. How the hell could I miss those? It's unbelievable. And down you go! You're not running away, are you? He don't let you run away. Okay, how could you... I don't think so. You are going straight to hell for that one. Behind me, I'm making double sure. I'm running into guys now. This is getting ridiculous. Unfortunately, something like that, a melee attack will bring them out of the day state. Goodbye. 
Now we're rocking. Somehow they're just gliding over to me. Gotta take care of the gun guy first. Take care of the most annoying bastard first. Ow. Damn it. Now I'm getting quadruple team here. Some. You. Okay, where's the guy with the keys? Yeah, you're the one. It's not looking so good right now. I hope it's gonna get better soon. That will help very, very much. Now we're talking. Yeah, like we didn't spend all of last video just slicing guys up. Oh, did you back the wrong horse there, Booby? Uh, and I think that's all. Yep, it is. And this is one of the more unique points in No More Heroes. You'll see what I mean in just a few seconds after I get my health back up. After getting quadrupled like that. Jesus. But now let's start this section. It's the only time you do it in the game. Well, rather, the only time you're forced into it. Ah, this is going to be a long ride. And he's already passed out. Alright, gotta remove the nunchuck. And now we're playing another game. Pure White Giant Glastonbury. Pretty much handles like Space Invaders or anything of that sort. Press the two button to swing your sword and the one button to shoot. It's pretty simple. And you get infinite lives, so don't worry about not getting to the end. Because you have to get to the end, pretty much. You can also deflect shots with your sword. It will come in handy very l later in the stage. Especially against things like that. You can also move up and down. Some things you just can't do in other things like this. And when that bar gets full, you unleash a super attack. You don't get none for the regular enemies though, just for their bullets. So it's often good to sometimes just go up to the bullets themselves and press A and you get to do your super attack. And while your super attack is going, no bullets can appear on screen. Also, we got three-way fire! Sweet. You either get three-way fire or two-way fire. You'll know which is which because one looks like a W and the other one looks like a T. Ow. That sucked. And when you die, you unfortunately lose it. Well, that lasted. Uh, that lasted. I'm not very good at this. Obviously, and you can just hold down the button to shoot. Okay, what hit me? Who's dead, SOB? No power ups. Not good. Really, this is only gonna hurt you if you're doing like a speedrun of this game. And I don't know if anyone else is planning on it. Alright, you can stop shooting now. Yeah, shark! Right now I gotta look out for these guys. Pretty much just like kamikaze missiles. But... <laughs> If you got a good enough rhythm, you can slice them down. 
Unless they got friends. Damn it. Triple shot. Warning. Okay, we're already to the quote-unquote boss of this little game. I do kind of like how they got worked the Suda 51 music into there. And again, it's their game, so, duh. I'm not sure if tapping works as fast as the holding, but do anything you wish. Yeah, it's a pretty simple boss. You just gotta look at how he's moving, where he's moving, and spam the hell out of your special. Because that's what's going to get you the farthest in here, because he's going to launch a lot of crap your way, and you don't want that in your face. Uh, aside from this, I'm not sure how to explain everything else. And once you beat this game, you're able to do it, you're able to play it again at your hotel, at the at the TV. So, play it at your leisure. Beat your score, beat your time, beat everything. Yeah, that's fine. I'm not, I don't really care about the little mini game. It's not my kind of, it's not my cup of tea. What is my cup of tea is slicing people in half. Wake up, Travis. It's your stop. So let's go. And it was all a dream. Just for the people who are watching this, count how many times I've died, and then I will be disappointed in myself. And I'm guessing it's a lot. What? Sylvia. Come on. You can do this. You're almost to the next ranked fight. Winners proceed to the fourth rank. Losers will also proceed to the eighth circle of hell. But you and I, Travis, we are going to paradise together. Take me by the hand and show me a world of drama and passion, one that I have never known before. But be sure to hit the bathroom first. <laughs> as soon as you are ready, come for me. Don't leave me waiting. Today, little Sylvia has done herself up quite well, I must say. My skin is so silky and smooth. This quote, charisma makeup artist from Japan gave me, like, the most incredible color gradation ever. I really hate how she says, Don Ducky, Don Ducky, like some stupid bimbo. And will you look at that? Today you are going to win with 2,000% certainty. One hot night together, you and me coming right up. A promise is a promise. Trust your force, Travis, and head for the Garden of Madness. What do you know? I actually made it up the stairs before she finished. That's kind of sad. And ba-boom! Even more stuff. Okay, am I full? Yeah, I'm guessing, yeah, I'm full. And pick up the Lucha Libre mask. What do we got? Travis should become a masterful pro wrestler. I think I'll book you book a match for you. But first a super hard suplex. Remember Satan's Ferris wheel, the dumber arm suplex. Again with the Ferris wheel. But anyway, we might as well take a nice fat save while we're at it. Surprised you didn't use this one the last time we were here. Oh well. Bow and arrow station. Mm. It's not as good as Body Slam Beach, but hey, whatever floats your boat. Let's 
see how this Harvey fares against someone like Travis Touchdown. Let's go! Am I missing anything? No. Let's go. You are late, Ansem. Hurry! The show's about to start. What's with all the excitement? It is not every day you get to watch a big fight from VIP seats. Of course I am excited, but I am most excited being with you. Whoa, you're serious. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Oh shit, oh shit. I'm packing heat, baby. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, and all killers out there, welcome to Harvey Vladarsky's Magic Freak Show of the Century! It'll be a killer night, so let's get started! It's showtime! Ha ha! Oh my! Quiet, quiet, please! What do you know? It's already time for the last program. But you know, today is a special day. And you, ladies and gentlemen, are lucky. So lucky that you might even get lucky. Now, one of you lucky people will be chosen to be up here with me. Who's it gonna be? The lucky person is... You! Well, Travis, this is your lucky night. Me? They want me? Serious? You gotta be kidding. Go get him, Tiger. Come on, no need to be shy. Congratulations, you nasty little boy. Tell the audience your name. Travis Touchdown. It's a good name, don't you think? It's a fine name indeed. You have your parents to thank for that. My parents are dead. Oops, a touchy subject. A question that should not be touched upon. That's okay. Really, it is. There, there, don't let it bother you. Hold on to your hopes and don't give up, my nasty little boy. Thanks. I'll remember that. So you came to enjoy the show? Damn right I did. I was really looking forward to this. It's the last show, right? Last show? Did I hear you right? Oh, you heard me right. Harvey, you're gonna die tonight, right here, by my hand. Let's close the curtains. I hope you aren't being serious. That would be a pity. We still have the main event to unveil. Playtime is over. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime! On to the grand finale! Now this is entertainment! Yeah! <laughs> it's killing time! We finally come face to face with Harvey Velodarsky. And is it just me or does he seem like he doesn't belong here? It's really odd, really. Because he seems like he's pretty normal, considering. Sure, the magic show is a bit weird, but it's kind of like that with all magic, really. And pretty much all of his attacks have something to do with magic or illusion. So, be prepared for the unexpected. And he does have a one-hit kill move, so be careful. As all annoying bosses do. But I don't believe he's that hard. He's a lot harder to avoid than he is to, uh, you know, 
He doesn't have that... He doesn't have that annoying spark that some of the other bosses or assassins do. You just gotta keep your distance from him and wait for a good opportunity. Otherwise, you're gonna get skewered. Out. He always teleports away. Thankfully, if you run far enough, he'll get her out. There's not very much to comment on right now, because he, he's barely even gotten hurt. All he's really doing is spinning and teleporting around like an idiot. Other than that, not much else. Watch this. <laughs> but hey, what do you expect? Here's the weakest katana. All right, there we go. Ha <laughs> ha! There's some damage for ya. Oh, here it is. Now he's gonna flip the freaking screen upside down. And at first, it might be a little confusing, but. You kind of get used to it fast enough. Again, with the spinning. I could easily just step outside of his range. Where are you? Yes. Quit spinning! You're not a ballerina! Okay, sends out birds. Not that it worked. And more upside down crap. It might be a little bit disorienting, but... But it's nothing really. Okay, I'm getting really annoyed by that. That's not his one hit kill move. You know when you see it. Birds. Strange. He's, Travis is making all these lightning quick moves. Yeah, it's not doing a damn thing. Right. Okay, you're making the screen go back upside down again. But that you're not doing very much. Thank you. Yeah, it's not doing it for some reason. He usually does it by like the halfway point. I'm kind of disappointed. I think I'm gonna go get my health. There we go. Watch this! Are you gonna do it or what, buddy? Still no. What's the deal? It's like his signature move. Why wouldn't he use it? I am so baffled right now. I got you down to a third of your health and you're still not using it. What is wrong with you, sir? Birds. Some angry birds. Yeah, couldn't have seen that coming. Use the damn move! It's kind of sad when I'm asking you to do it. And this is getting ridiculous. We've seen this trick before. Do something different, please. We've seen this, we've seen the upside down, we've seen the birds. Come on, dude. Okay, he's finally gonna do it. Jesus. This is the one hit kill move. Basically, it's the magic box act. 
Only this time, the person inside will actually die. Assistance. Sorry if I bumped my mic. It's showtime. Basically, the idea with this is to do whatever the thing prompts you to do. If you don't do it, do it enough times in a small amount of time, Travis's body will fall outside of it. Except I did it right, therefore I am safe. <laughs> So that's what I was looking for. Finally, jeez. Get down to like a quarter of your health before you actually do it. You got jerk. Don't know why it took him that long. Something must be wrong. And now he's making me do it upside down. Unbelievable. Now, and it most likely will be a different prompt each time. I knew he was going to make me do that eventually. Alright. And I am safe. And you can skip it anytime you wish. Music, begin! We're doing it twice in a row? Come on, man! Now it's getting ridiculous. Jesus, man. Okay, I survived. Obvious. The button prompts are, or the thrust prompts are gonna be kinda awkward to do since they're upside down. But hey, I proved that I can do a lot of things in this. Even do shit upside down. Again? Really? Might as well pick up that battery pickup. Since it's just gonna keep on spinning there forever. And I'm safe. Quite simple. Yeah, if you're far away enough, he'll use his birds on you. Down to the pink. It's not good. Not good at all. Damn it. Yeah, this is pretty much where you get a free hit on him whenever he does the upside down. Upside down shtick. Come on, let me throw you. Where are you going? Birds again? How did you even get here? And now for another trick. You might as well just stand in the middle of it, because it'll catch up with you eventually, so there's no avoiding it. I knew that was going to happen. Survive. Come on, man. You're boring my viewers. Boring me is one thing, but the viewers, those are a completely different story. You know I'm not even trying to, like, take my time, I just want to bash his brains out. Being violent today. Together, and down. I'm gonna slice you open. Like so. Good night, Harvey. It's dark! Somebody turn on the lights! I can't see shit! Oh, how am I supposed to perform in total darkness? Hit the lights! Hurry up! I can't see! It's dark! I'm surrounded by darkness!
Now that is something America, America's Got Talent really needs. <laughs> ah, beautiful. The name is Travis Touchdown. Thank you all for coming tonight. I hope you enjoyed the show. I would also like to thank you for coming this evening. As a result, Travis Touchdown is now ranked fourth place. And the show will go on. I hope to see you all again soon. And, and have, have a, a good, good night. night. Well, that took forever, but finally, we're in the final four. Or, or should I say, final three now. Dear Lord, he took forever. Just the deer disappearing shit, and the freaking birds. And he took forever to do that, the, the one-hit kill move, jeez. It didn't even touch me once. Might as well see what Diane is up to. Hi, this is Diane from Beefhead Videos. We're calling to let you know that the video you returned was a copy of one of our video titles. Um, the best of raunchy amateur interviews, too? You didn't seem to copy the whole tape, though. It ended two minutes into the middle of the first interview. Anyway, please be sure to return the original tape you borrowed. Thank you! Good morning, Mr. Touchdown. Are you on the throne again? Please wire us the money now. Damn, these bastards keep on getting greedier and greedier. Uh, but I... Do I, ex I expected a lot more, really. But they always go by up by the same amount. Uh, I got all these. How the hell did I miss those two? And no, I will not let it go. Shall see our TV? Not that you will see. Video game! Kinda looks like an N64 cartridge with some of its sides cut off. But I guess that's what you that's what you get. But anyway, next time let's play No More Heroes. I may actually do the the Love Cove montage. Either that or it'll just be the basic shits of side jobs and the killing missions. I'll see you guys for either or.